Okay, so I've just pulled up at Glanford Park, Attis Arena. And, um, yep, I'm nervous. So let's get out there and see what our else is feeling like. Just some scores for tonight. 5 0 Scunny. Yeah, I'm going 2 0 Scunny. Tonight, going for a 2 1 iron. Come on. 1 0. 1 0. Conservative. Okay, I'm in the iron bar this time, my yeah. Right, I've got Ryan with me, just being on the radio. Made me more nervous. Thanks, Ryan. What score do you reckon tonight, mate? I'm going to go 2 0 Scunny. Steve, door smasher. What's going on? I reckon we'll win. I reckon it'll be 2 1. And they'll score. And we'll go 2 0 up. They'll score. And then we'll be squeaky bum time for the last 10 minutes. <laughs> I hope not. I hope not. That's how it normally goes with Scuddy. Anyway, cheers, Fingers crossed. Enjoy the game. I'm walking away from the ground to meet Dill, and I bumped into Rob. Yeah, how are you, Gareth? Nice I'm to see really you. Good. I'm really uh, good. Place feels like it's buzzing tonight, and I haven't even got to the uh, stadium yet. Yeah. Um, I just hope if the proper Scunthorpe turn up, I don't think there's a team can beat us in the league at home. I really believe that. I think we're the best side at home. And um, I said all week we'll win by two clear goals. So whether that's two nil or three one, we'll go for it. And they can't let us down tonight. The team can't let us down tonight. Okay, so it's a massive game tonight. First versus seconds. I've said before. We're second, Tamworth first, nine points clear. We've got to win, basically. And um, we've recalled Dion Sambi Ferris from Peterborough Sports. He's been doing well there. But a few injuries, we've had to do it, you know? So we've just got to get on that front foot from the very off. The crowd have got to get behind them. Am I nervous? Of course I'm nervous. We need the points, we need to win. They'll be happy with the draw. So, you know, let's get into them from the off. Let's hope we're smiling in 90 minutes time. I reckon we're going to concede early and win 3-1. Yeah. Come on, Jack. I think it's going to be a tight game today. First versus second. Uh, one goal in it, 2-1. This is Scunthorpe United! Hi, the fans. We're here at the Atlas Arena and you are the 12th man. Get behind the boys in Parrot Blues. Okay, I'm still with Joe in the ground. What scores do I think, Joe? I reckon 3-2. And the important thing is, nothing could possibly go wrong. Go on, Spinny! Yeah, this is a big one. This is the one we need to win. Oh, that is a hell of a throw. So, I'll have to be, keep, keep alert for those set pieces. Because they're going to cause us issues. They kicked it into the end of the avenue. Shut up! Shut up! Drown. Oh, that's a good one. Simmons there twice. Let's just weather this storm. Let the nerves settle. And uh, hopefully get into them. Possibly Tamworth. Oh! They're just edging it. You can see why they're up there. They're causing issues, they're causing problems. Oh! Well, the nerves aren't getting any easier. Free kick for them. There, nice passing, nice through ball. Does Clonan ever shoot though? He's always looking for that pass. I've never seen him shoot. No one there. Now I know we turn some more about refs week in, week out. What was the reason for that? This one's giving absolutely nothing. Genuinely. Well, to us anyway. For me, we're just rushing it. 
We're just not, no, just not composed, not, you know, we've possibly got more time. We just seem nervous, we're just rushing it, trying to get the pass forward. Fair play to Tamworth, you know, they're creating issues for us, putting us under pressure, and then closing the ball down. Go on! So, it's nil nil at half time, but for me, I'm going to say Tampa for being a better team. You know, they've pressed more, they've looked like they've won the ball more. This is a massive second half for both of the teams. Um, you know, a draw for them, that's fine, you know, they're gonna, they'll take a draw. We need three points. We need to get into them. We need to find another gear for me. Yeah, we seem a bit like I said, we seem too slow. Oh! Too methodical, you know. We just need to get at them. Oh! Feel my earlier comment about not seeing Clunan and shooting. We have now. Absolutely. Well, that could change things. Um, that has been sent off first. Pull his man back. Last man. But he had to do it, you know. It's a professional foul. Um, yeah. It's on the right on the edge of the box as well. No, 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 no. Oh. This has a feeling, this game, of when it takes all. That's what it feels like, you know. down and obviously they're just you know finding that space stepping it up a little bit once again we've got no one on the halfway line the ball gets cleared that's gonna get put straight back in 44 Danny Whitehall you just say 44 come on James no 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 Ooh. 19 minutes left plus any stoppages Joe's just said to me, they have a habit of scoring late goals, don't they? Cheers. Scrappy, as you saw, it's gone in though, it's all that matters. They've scored, it's gone in. I bet I get blamed for this. <laughs> yeah, is that the title? 12 points now, it's a long way. Yeah, we've got two games now, that still takes it to six. But you know, they've come here and they've performed. That's all you can ask your team to do. And they've done it. So if you travel from Tamworth, or you follow Tamworth, then you'd be more than happy. What a reaction save that was. Our corners are absolutely useless. 
You start watching the clock tick down, you know, and I can't see a score. Once again, we yeah. underperform in front of that big crowd. Um, but fair play to Sam was, you know, they've come with a game plan. They've stuck to it, it's worked. And, you know, deserve all the credit they've got for being up there for winning tonight. The thing is, we can't let our heads drop, even though mine's dropped. We can't let our heads drop, we've got to keep going and just hope. But others beat Tamworth. Tamworth just keeping it in the corner now, just killing the clock, which is what you're going to do, isn't it? Yeah, it's, you know, gutting, but it is what it is, isn't it? It's football. We've still got points to pick up. We're just not winning any second balls at all, you know, we're knocking it down, it's getting knocked down. And we're not winning anything, there's no one there. That didn't go to games. Ugh. But, you know, fair play to him, you can hear him there, top of the league. And they are, they were top of the league anyway. This wasn't our night at all. You know, I know from the speech, got to be on the front foot, we've got to go for it, but, you know, they matched us fair and square. Played the game, did what they had to, and won. So, credit to them. Over 5,000 Scunthorpe fans here. Like it's just so flat. You know, it just, it's like we've had everything sucked out of us. I mean, watch that. Thank you for your support this evening. It's like my friend is about to have some sort of time to say. Big thank you to the players, Matt Schultz, and Steve Stoke, and Matt Setchell. They're close to my match, number one, Russell. Okay, it's so after the game, everyone is deflated. Well, I am anyway. Joe, how are you feeling? Well, let's get this over and done with. Um, hats off, oh, sorry. Hats off to Tamworth. They were the better team on the day. Yep. Uh, it was. Uh, this feels worse than when we got relegated into this league in the first place, if I'm honest. And it does feel like it's over. It's not over, but you know, best case scenario, we win them two games in hand. We're still six spots behind. And, yeah. Um, I'd tear up a little bit. It's, it's hard. Um, Whitehall had tears in his eyes when he came off, bless him, and I think one of the other players did as well. It's just, it's hard for everyone, but you know, ultimately, the better team won on the day. To put it in the simplest possible way, they scored a goal. We had a million chances, we didn't fall away, and it's as simple as that. I think everything that possibly could have gone wrong did go wrong. Ogle picked up an injury, I think. And I'm not blaming the referee, but we got nothing and you know there's a minute when the ball went out and the referee said it didn't and you know there's one where it was a, a, goal, a goal kick he said it was a corner all sorts of stuff like that there was a blatant elbow that I think should have been a red card um, and then for some reason our guy got sent off a few seconds later I was too busy shouting at the referee uh, so then it's about a second, five seconds where I was really happy with what they got, got sent off. <laughs> so that was the best bit of the day for me. I was, for about five seconds, I was really happy. <laughs> um, yeah, so no, this, this is hard and it's going to take some time to process because it, it really hurts. Um, sorry, I'm not going to cry. So in a club I love so much, um, stuck, in, um, stuck in this league, um, going to these awful stadiums, it hurts. They're not crying, it's the air conditioning unit above us. But it's hard. Uh, you know, we'll go, we'll go again. There's, there's the playoffs. Uh, we can still win the playoffs. And um, as much as I don't want to say it yet, if Tamworth, if you do win the league, more power to you because you deserve it. And any, any other season, 
I would be right there saying, you know what, congratulations. Yeah. But it's it's just how this this awful league is. It's one automatic promotion spot, and in fairness, if they do it, they deserve it. You know, let's go again. We're back here on Saturday. If anybody's really depressed on uh, Thursday and thinks I'm so depressed, I don't know what to do. Uh, nine o'clock, uh, the cleanup <laughs> team are here. Thursday morning, uh, cleaning away the rubbish. Uh, so uh, yeah, that's an offer to you all. And yeah, um, we go again. Up the iron there. Thank you. Three shots, more no shots for Scully. Okay, I've got Ryan with me after that game. It's about uh, an hour after actually. So a few beverages. What did you think, Ryan? Come on, be honest. Um, I thought we were shit, mate, to be honest. Um, yeah, I think we played the occasion and not the game. Mm -hmm. um, I thought Tam was a decent side. You could see why they're where they are. Yep. Um, they yep. defended well. Um, they, they were strong. But we were, we were fucking shit. Um, we didn't come out. The ref, he was a man, even. He was crap. Yeah. There's been a few complaints about the ref. Do you know what? Six months ago, we, didn't, we barely had a ground, we barely had a club. So, yeah. at the end of the day, yeah. on, it's still onwards and upwards. Yeah. You know, if we can't win the league, which I don't think we will now. I said if we lost tonight, I don't think we'll win the league. Yeah. Um, but we can do it through the playoffs. Um, I still worry a bit about that because, like I say, all it takes is a night like tonight where a team yeah. frustrates us and we have a poor ref. Yeah. That ref was an absolute clown. I don't know if he's in here in that exact lounge after the game, looking, laughing, and giggling. Because I won't be giggling if I perform like that. That was embarrassing. But anyway, um, yeah, playoffs are going to be. Yeah, I, I, we will get the playoffs. I know I've seen a few bits saying, "Oh, we're not even going to get playoffs." We will get the playoffs. Yeah. I think we'll come second. There's too much of a gap going on, but. Yeah, let's see how we do. If we don't go up, it's not the end of the world. We'll be here next season. We'll still be in here. Gareth will eventually get a round in. So. <laughs> it's not going to happen. No, it's not going to happen. But onwards and upwards. And up the iron. Iron Army as well. Cheers, Top Ryan. Channel.